Hey everyone and welcome to Living in Ottawa. In this week's episode, we're gonna cover the neighborhood of Old Barhaven East on the south side of Ottawa. But first, show reel, hit it. Welcome to Old Barhaven East. This neighborhood is in the suburb of Barhaven and is bounded by the Fallowfield Road to the north, Strandherd Road to the south, Greenbank Road to the east, and the CN Rail Line to the west. Established in the 1960s, Barhaven was one of a group of new suburban areas built across the Ottawa Greenbelt. And the neighborhood includes the communities of Longfields, Davidson Heights, and is home to two great high schools and four elementary schools. As in any old established neighborhood, you're going to find a mix of old and new, big and small houses, fully grown trees, and conveniences and parks all around. That's what makes this suburb so great in Barhaven. Let's go check it out. I know you're just going to fall in love with it. So one of the unique things about the Old Barhaven East neighborhood is actually the Via Rail station. This is a newer station that was put in place and actually has commutes that go on the Via Rail line that goes all the way to Montreal or comes in from Toronto. And this is a great little addition because we have the original Via Rail station just in the east end of downtown Ottawa. But this is the secondary station that they built here out in Barhaven. So one of the unique things about the Old Barhaven East neighborhood is actually the public transit. A lot of folks will actually live as a commuter town in Barhaven East and they'll actually use the public transit here. OC Transpo is the largest provider of public transit in Ottawa. So people actually sleep and live in Barhaven, but then they can take the OC Transpo downtown and they actually have dedicated commuter lanes that will bring them right downtown. And that can actually avoid the bumper to bumper traffic that you see during rush hour traffic. And some folks will actually come and they use the park and ride system here where they can leave their car and as part of their membership, they can use the public transit to get downtown. Now, if you do avoid parking downtown, that sometimes can actually save you anywhere from 200 to 300 to $400 a month on your monthly expenses when you budget.
So one of the unique things about the old Barhaven East area is that it's actually one of the original neighborhoods in Barhaven. And so we have a mix of different types of architecture from the 70s and 80s. And now we see a lot of infill projects as this neighborhood starts to turn over. So we have infill projects of single homes, but then we actually have plots of land like this where it's an entire project of new condos and association fee private lanes that offer new services such as these parks and trails that merge into the older Barhaven area. So there you guys have it, Old Barhaven East. What a beautiful neighborhood for the relocating family. Speaking of relocating, if you're thinking about making a move, feel free to reach out to us. Give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email, even wrap it up in a bow and send it on via rail because we got your back. We're moving to Ottawa, we're moving to Barhaven or anywhere across Canada. And each and every week, we're bringing brand new videos just like this one. So make sure to tap that subscribe button and click the bell. So notified each and every time we do a brand new video. Till next time, take care. This is much newer in the old Ottawa, uh, sorry, old Barhaven East area. Actually, the neighborhood itself is one of the original, it's windy, isn't it? Even wrap it up in a bow and send it first class. <laughs> Be real. So there you guys have it. Old Ottawa East. What a beautiful neighborhood. Old Ottawa East, no? Yeah. No, not old Ottawa. <clears throat>